Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got the system of equations a times b equals to 1 divided by 2, b times c is 1 divided by 3, and a times c is 1 divided by 6. And now we are going to solve for 1 divided by a square plus 1 divided by b square plus 1 divided by c square. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we are going to do. Since we are interested in uh, finding the value of this 1 divided by a square plus uh, 1 divided by b square plus 1 divided by c square. So let's go ahead and manipulate uh, this part. And here I have copied down this uh, expression over here. And now our task is uh, to put a, a square, b square, c square in the denominator. So therefore we are going to manipulate this uh, very first term. So I'm going to multiply and uh, divide by b square, c square on the top and uh, b square, c square at the bottom as well. Likewise, uh, in the second uh, term, I'm going to multiply and divide by a square, c square on the top and at the bottom a square c square as well and finally for this uh, third term i'm going to multiply and divide by a square b square divided by a square b square now let's go ahead and multiply on the top and multiply at the bottom as well so one times b square c square is b square c square divided by this is going to give us a square b square c square and likewise for this second term i'm going to write down plus we are going to multiply on the top and the bottom as well so this is going to give us a square c square divided by a square b square c square and finally plus we are going to multiply the top and the bottom as well. So that is going to give us a square b square divided by a square b square c square. And now we can see we got at the denominator a square b square c square across the board as you can see. And here I have copied it down. Let's go ahead and manipulate this one. And let's focus on this uh, a square. a square could be written as a times a. b square could be written as b times b. And finally c square could be written as c times c. And now let's go ahead and rearrange them. I'm going to put uh, a times b and then uh, b times c and then uh, a times c. Let me go ahead and write down a times b times b times c and c times a and we can see our a times b equals to 1 divided by 2 so therefore i'm going to replace this one by 1 divided by 2 likewise bc equals to 1 divided by 3 so therefore i'm going to replace this bc by 1 divided by 3 and finally ac is 1 divided by 6 so here i'm gonna replace this uh, ca by 1 divided by 6 and if we multiply numerator and the denominator we are going to get 1 divided by 36 so therefore a square b square c square turns out to be 1 divided by 36 and here's our next step let's go ahead and manipulate uh, these uh, parts uh, in the numerator so therefore uh, this first term could be written as uh, i'm going to tweak it uh, bc whole square divided by a square b square c square plus uh, likewise for this uh, second term could be written as uh, a c whole square divided by a square b square c square and finally plus uh, this uh, last term this could be written as a b whole square divided by a square b square c square 
And now we can see BC is equal to 1 divided by 3. AC is 1 divided by 6. And finally, A times B is 1 divided by 2. And in the denominator, A square, B square, C square, we already figured out it is equal to 1 divided by 36. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in these terms. So this is going to be 1 divided by 3 whole square divided by 1 divided by 36 plus likewise we're going to replace this one by 1 divided by 6 whole square divided by 1 divided by 36 and plus finally this is going to be 1 divided by 2 whole square divided by 1 divided by 36 and now we can see 1 over 3 whole square is same as 1 divided by 9 1 divided by 6 whole square is 1 divided by 36 and 1 over 2 whole square is 1 fourth so therefore this very first uh, fraction is going to become uh, 1 divided by 9 whole everything uh, 1 divided by 36 plus this uh, second term is going to become uh, 1 divided by 36 uh, all over 1 divided by 36 as well plus finally this last one is going to be 1 divided by 4 all over 1 divided by 36 and now let's recall this uh, basic rule of these uh, fractions pretty quick if we have uh, a divided by b and then all over c divided by d then we are going to multiply these outsiders over here a times d and we put it on the numerator and then we multiply these insiders b times c and we put it uh, in the denominator therefore we are going to use this uh, rule over here so therefore this first term could be written as uh, 36 uh, divided by 9 and here this whole thing cancels out so we ended up with just simply 1 plus uh, this last term could be written as uh, 36 uh, divided by 4 and finally 36 divided by 9 could be written as uh, 4 plus 1 36 divided by 4 is same as 9 and if we add everything that is going to give us 14 and that's our answer so thus our simplified answer to this problem turns out to be 14 thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye